Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Long time no see. I know on my Instagram I mentioned that I was gonna be throwing out all these YouTube videos and this and that, and I do have like four different YouTube videos already ready. I just haven't posted them, okay? So I was slacking, but I wasn't slacking because I was recording, okay? So I just have to finish editing them and then post them, but yeah. <laughs> so my apologies, but today we have a Define try on haul and review. I am a Define athlete, so I do have a code with them if you guys want to support me and save a little bit of money. And if you do use my code, please, please, please DM me because I want to thank you guys because without you guys supporting me, I am not able to work with these brands. So it's literally all thanks to you. So yeah. But with that being said, this video is not sponsored at all. I am not getting paid to make this. I wasn't asked to make this. I don't have to make this. However, I want to give you guys a review because I know a lot of you guys are curious about this. So that's that. Um, but without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so the first piece that I'm wearing is the Origin Minimal Sports Bra in a size small. And I originally, on the last month, I got a size X small and I love the size X small if it's great and everything. However, I do plan on growing my back even more um, within these next few months. So I needed something that was going to be more comfortable like on my lat area right here just because I, I don't want it to like squeeze me so hard to the point where it's like uncomfortable you know what I mean so I did get a size small and at the moment it is not I wouldn't say big it's not big okay it fits really nice and everything however I did find that the straps like move a little bit more just a tiny tiny bit it's not even noticeable like to other people but I feel it just a tiny tiny bit but a size x small or a small is literally perfect on me like it's fine another thing is is that these bras have been my absolute favorite like i love them so much and the reason i love them so much is one the quality like the fabric is so soft like buttery soft not lululemon soft don't get it twisted but it is super soft super comfortable and then my favorite thing is is that i am a part of the itty bitty titty committee so with that being said i don't have a lot to work with up there and this just makes the girls look so nice. It's so, so flattering and I I love it. I think she's a moment. Now for me, I don't feel like I'm gonna have a nip slip. I haven't had like a moment where like I go like this and something pops out. Okay, and now for the shorts. So I am wearing the Impact shorts in the color Lunar Rock and a size small. And I really, really like these. Honestly, I thought, I was so, so scared because I thought these were gonna be sheer just because of the color. It's very, very close to white. It's like a light gray, but they are not sheer. And also you have to remember that the impact fabric is very thick, okay? It's not thin. The only part that is thin is this part, but that's so that way your glutes can like pop out. Does that make sense? Because there, you have to remember that there is compression on the impact shorts. I mean, this is literally how I end up looking at the gym, but I don't mind it. Like, it looks, it looks amazing. Like, she's giving. She's definitely giving. So this is how they would normally sit, like, without being pulled up or anything, which is a really good length. I'm sure that they could stay like this. However, sometimes I'll go like that, and then that's how eventually they'll end up rolling up. But um, this is the back. And this is how they look like without being adjusted or anything, just like there. So look right here, all of this right here in this area has like a ribbed compression type of material. And then it's, a, it's really thick right here. So I don't ever have my cellulite showing right here, just obviously right here. I carry more cellulite on the back of my leg, which I don't care where the shorts girl, it's literally normal, but whatever. Just letting you guys know for those that want to avoid that this material is a lot thinner so that way your glute can like pop out like that giving it that like oop effect and then the waistband is three tiered but i will say that there's a lot of room for me and i don't ever feel like super sucked in and tight and like compressed on my waistband so just letting you guys know. So this is honestly my favorite color out of all of them. So one thing I haven't mentioned is the waistband, like where it ends. And I'm 5'5", five, five, like in between 5'4 and 5'5". Five, five. The waistband comes up to here, like my belly button. I could pull it up a little bit more if I wanted to. 
However, generally it sits right here. That's where it sits. So I know there's some shorter girlies that like that because usually they, they get like the waistband to come all the way up here and it makes their torso look squished. These mid-rise shorts look so good on tall girlies. If you have seen a tall girlie wearing a Define short, like it just looks so good on her. So love. Okay, next color. Okay guys, so the next pair of shorts that we have on are the dynamic shorts in a size X small and the color mellow yellow. So for me, I don't feel like I'm ever at a perfect size, if that makes sense. Like I'm always, always in between an X small and a small for any brand. Like it just, I'm, it always varies. But I feel like for impact, you could definitely stay true to size, but for dynamic, you could size down. That's why I did an X small because I feel like the small would have been a little too big and I would have had a lot of extra fabric right here just because this part is really, really stretchy. There's not a lot of compression right here, like in your uterus, but there is a lot of compression in the waistband. I will say that the waistband on the Dynamic is definitely tighter than the Impact. And I feel like it's also a little bit taller, if I'm correct. If not, let's check. Okay, it's just like, I think it's like the tiniest, tiniest bit taller, if not the same. Dynamic does have the compression right here around your thigh area. So this little part right here is tight. And I do feel like tightness level is the same as the impact. However, this part of like where the compression is, is not as tight as the impact. The effect isn't as dramatic, I feel like on the dynamic as the impact, but there is still compression. And then the fabric thins out in your glute area to give it that lift. So I feel like if you don't want such a dramatic effect like the impact, you could definitely get the dynamic. So this color yellow, I feel like it definitely is the sheerest color that I got. I would say that the Lunar Rock is squat proof. I know I forgot to do a squat test, but this one is definitely like, if you have a tattoo, you're definitely going to see it on your butt. Um, just letting you know. But I'm wearing a nude thong through this whole haul and I feel fine. Um, the only thing is how I did mention that the fabric right here is thinner. You can see your underwear like lines. Okay, so just keep that in mind. But yeah, this color I'm obsessed with. I know on camera it comes out to be really pale. It's a little bit more vibrant in person and I love that. Like I just, it's it's a really, really, really pretty yellow, especially for summer. It's just beautiful. I feel like this would go great with tan skin. So I would say that if you want a little bit more tummy control and you like higher waistbands, definitely go with Dynamic. And then if you like the more mid-rise, not low-rise, the mid-rise look and more dramatic compression on your glutes, I would say get impact. So that's that. <laughs> okay guys, so this next set is from their new collection. It's called the Revive Collection. I'm sure you guys have already heard of it. It's been released for like a month now. Very, very, very cute. I'm wearing the shorts like this just to show you how they sit normally without being adjusted at all. So they go pretty low, but I just don't feel like this is flattering. So again, I do just go like this and I like move my legs. And then this one doesn't have any scrunch. So you do kind of have to work with the fabric to manipulate it, to get it in there. So that way you don't have that unibutt look. So the material is definitely very, very soft, but it's rigid enough to have the the fabric stay in there. I've had issues in the past where the fabric of like leggings or shorts is so, so thin and soft and stretchy that it does not stay in there, okay? It kind of flares out as you're squatting or something, but this one, like you can squat and be perfectly fine. It's gonna stay in there. These are not see-through at all. The material is definitely very, very different from the impact or the dynamic. A little bit of in between of Gymshark and navigation, but yeah, very, very stretchy. Um, I did, I think I forgot to mention the colors. So I'm wearing the ice gray set in everything top and bottom size X small. I was really worried when I first opened my package and I saw the sports bra because the sports bra looked so small. And I was like, oh my God, like, 
I really messed up, you know? But then I tried it on and it fit perfectly because since the straps are not adjustable, they, they just kind of sit like this, you know? It would have hung way too low on me, causing gaping. Okay, I've heard some athletes be like, I don't really like this, but I feel like if you don't want that super dramatic effect on the glutes and you just want something that's like comfortable and makes you feel good, makes you look good, I feel like the Revive Collection is definitely that for you. The waistband is a high rise waistband. Definitely like can come up all the way right there if I wanted it to, but it normally sits right above my belly button. I do feel like the compression on this is pretty good, but it's it's medium. It's not like gonna hold you in like Alphalete or even Navigation. Like I don't feel that it's like that tight, you know what I mean? Like the dynamic, but it's definitely there. It's, it's just a very, very stretchy material. So I'd say that if you're in between sizes, I would size down. And then one thing I did forget to mention is the back of this bra. So... It's an open back, just like the minimal sports bra, and I love it. It's super, super minimal, but super dainty and pretty. But yeah, that's that. Okay, next one. Now I'm gonna show you guys the Origin Minimal Sports Bra in black. Again, I got this in a size small because I do plan on growing my back even more, but this is the back. Super minimal open back moment. I've worn this for back day, and I just, it's so, flattering you can see all your muscles moving really really beautiful even for chest day like it's giving it's giving it kind of gives this little boost i don't know what they put in this bra but it's so beautiful i just love it like it she's just she's giving okay guys so the next color that i have is the revive sports bra size x small in electric blue and then i have the dynamic shorts size x small in a light powder blue love look at this like she's giving she's giving i feel like you can mix and match these two they're just really pretty i don't know if you guys can see it on camera but it has like a little hint of little light blues that match with the light powder blue and i just think it's so beautiful and i've had some people ask me okay if you could only get one like dynamic or impact what would you get and i always say it just depends on your preference because i find that i reach for dynamic when i am feeling bloated or like sort of insecure on my stomach sometimes so i always reach for dynamic just because there's more tummy control okay and they're they still provide that lift but on days where i'm feeling better about my tummy um i do notice i reach for the impact shorts and i also like the impact shorts for glute day just because i feel like there's more blood flow going to your booty so the pump is bigger i don't know that could just be a mental thing but that's just how i see it okay these are definitely lighter color and i feel like if you do have a tattoo here you could probably see it because look how sheer that is like you could definitely probably see your tattoo there, but thong wise, you can't see the color. I've worn these with a black thong and you can't see the color. Okay, so they, they're they good. Like, trust me, like you'll be fine. You will be fine. Okay, so that is everything that I got. So now I'm gonna be showing you guys everything that I got last month. I will not be trying these pieces on, but I will be showing you guys and talking to you guys about them, okay? I do apologize if the lighting is a little weird. The sun keeps coming and then going and then coming and then going. The first item that I'm gonna show y'all are the 4.5 impact shorts in the color pistachio. All of my impact I get in a size small just because my quads are bigger. It would just be way too tight on my quads if I got an X small. But if you do want that like more dramatic lifted effect, you could definitely size down to an X small. I like to be comfortable. So this is what they look like. They're a really pretty, I feel like they should have named this color forest green just because it's so, it's giving forest green vibes. Like it's so, so beautiful. The material is so thick, not see-through at all. Like literally not see-through. Like they're just so good. So, so, so good. Three-tiered waistband. This color I feel like looks really pretty on all skin tones. And then I got the impact shorts in the color light rose pink and also a size small. I love pink. 
I am a very, very, very girly girl. I love pink, okay? This pink is so beautiful. It's like a pale pastel -y type of pink. It's beautiful, okay? And this with fair or tan skin looks amazing. If you're, I feel like if you're a girly girl and you're like, oh, I don't know what color to get, get the pink, get the pink. You, I have reworn this like five times already. Like this, my favorite, my favorite, my favorite, my favorite. So the next pair of shorts that I got were the dynamic shorts in a size X small and the color fresh green. It's not on camera. It's not picking up the actual shade of the color, I would say. It's coming out more pale on camera and dull. It's definitely a really, really beautiful, pretty green. Just search up pastel green and this will probably be it because it's beautiful. I love, love, love this. Sheerness wise, I wouldn't, I feel like on the dynamic shorts, this part is just, or maybe it was just the yellow. Maybe it was just the yellow, but I feel like on the dynamic shorts, you can definitely see your underwear lines right here, like at the front, okay? But you can't see the color. So they're not color sheer, but they are like line sheer, if that makes sense, okay? And I feel like if you have a tattoo, you would probably see it on the butt part just because remember, the material is a lot thinner. So that way your glutes like lift up. The next thing that I got were the impact leggings in the color electric blue size x small um i feel like x small is definitely tight on your quad but for me i like a tight fit um it's not tight to the point where it's uncomfortable and i can't breathe for someone who likes normal compression to maybe more subtle compression i do feel like you could just stick true to size i'm not a big leggings girl i just don't feel like they flatter my legs as much as the shorts so i find that i don't really reach for these the color is beautiful but i don't really reach for these and also i do feel like the lift is not as on these i don't really reach for leggings in general like i'm just, i'm not even hating on these like just in general but i find that when i wear these with like a fitted shirt they look so nice i feel like they look nicer like that than when i wear them with a sports bra like my torso looks like a square there's not a lot of compression and i've noticed that with the impact when i get home from working out and i have to like do something like whether it's work related or like edit a video or any of that i can sit like on my couch or on my chair or whatever and be fine because i noticed that whenever i wear navigation or um alphalete i can't sit like that for too long but i find that for impact because the waistband is so stretchy and not as compressive and snug i can sit there comfortably you know what i mean okay guys so the next thing i'm going to show y'all is the dynamic high neck backless sports bra in the color light stone gray and a size x small or no wait yes wait no wait maybe well yeah it's an x small okay if i would have gotten a small i would have had a lot of gaping and extra fabric I feel like this is true to size. Again, I say true to size, but I'm always in between X small and small. I got an X small. It fits perfectly fine. One thing that I really, really like about this, I don't find it very flattering on me, but I feel like it would look more flattering on bigger chested girls just because I'm so flat. It kind of just like shoves everything like in there. But if you have bigger yiddies, I feel like you would love this because it's just more compressive. I know a lot of bigger yiddy girlies complain about like, this part because of side boob i don't get that but i don't know if y'all would get side boob on this maybe if you have like double d's or something maybe but i feel like c's you would be fine in this one thing that i really like about this is how minimal the back is i feel like define just does a really good job with creating sports bras that have minimal um straps which is really really pretty just because the way the design is set up it really flatters and emphasizes your shoulders and your biceps so that's why i say that this part is not uncomfortable at all it is a little bit of like a higher rise but it's not uncomfortable um if in between sizes i would say size up just because it is snug and compressive 
Okay, Slay. Sorry, I just got a message from the girls group chat. Okay. Um, all of these sports bras that I've talked about have removable cup pads. Every product that I'm going to talk about has removable cup pads, okay? Right here, it has this stitching, which I really, really like because I have a similar top from Gymshark. And I like I have to take out the pads and put them behind because the pads move around and so sometimes I'll look like I have a boob right here and then my other boob is right here but with this one since they did like stitching you see they did four stitching the bra the or the cup pads stay right here they do not go up here which I really really appreciate not a lot of brands think about that very nicely done. Okay guys, so this next shirt that I got is the Hannah Pearson twist back crop top in the color sand dune and a size small. I have a similar lazuli label top in a size X small and I find that the lazuli one is stretchier, it sits better and I reach for it more. This one I've worn once and I did not I did not like it and the reason I did not like it was because I stuck to a size small and it was still very tight um, So I just feel like the sizing isn't it wasn't done correctly I also feel like the arm area right here is just Too tight this part on the neck is too tight as well It's very uncomfortable this part right here is just too tight and it's a very thick material so having something be tight and then thick as well it's just not i don't know i don't reach for this top maybe had i sized up to a medium i probably would have liked it a little bit better however i feel like there would have been much more extra fabric in this part right here because the issue that i have with this top is that the back yes the back is super nice and open and super flattering for back day but this part right here when you wear it it kind of like squishes like this so it forms like a little hole like that like i try to pull it down every time and it just rides back up i feel like you could get better quality with like lazuli label the only thing is is that lazuli label does not come with cut pads and this one does it comes with removable cut pads and the stitching there's you can't see it on camera but the stitching there's like a little stitching right here so the again the removable cup pads stay in place okay which i really appreciate but the open back is a moment i feel like if you're smaller in your arms and i don't even do arms like that like i do arms maybe like once every other week if you have smaller arms than me you probably wouldn't mind this but even then like it's just not i don't know i don't find that i reach for this a lot and i'm really disappointed because i love shirts like this it's just not it's not a vibe if i'm gonna be honest last but not least i got the origin minimal sports bra in a size x small i actually got it in the color smoked sage it's just the color looks very similar to ugh, i call it forest green but it's not forest green this dark green okay it looks very similar like when you wear these two together they pretty much look the same but i find that this one is probably a little bit more bluish than this one this one's a little bit more green this fits so nice i don't have an issue with the straps moving at all everything stays in place the girlies stay perky looking amazing the back so flattering if you're gonna get any sports bra get the origin minimal sports bra you will not regret okay i don't know if i would recommend this to the itty bitty or not the itty bitty the bigger titty committee just because it's very showy okay and it's not very supportive for bigger yeeties but for small yeeties that want a little lift this bra i don't know what they put in it i swear to god i don't know what they put in it it's amazing love it get this okay so that is everything that i got you guys my foot fell asleep every time i shake my head it works and like it helps my foot wake up but i'm not gonna do that on camera because that'd be a little weird i think the sun is coming back up now because the lighting changed for a little bit oh my god oh my god now both my feet fell asleep i hate when your feet fall asleep i hate it i hate it i hate it oh i feel the tingles um i'm so sorry for this outro but if you guys do wish to support me uh, again i always always appreciate it so please dm me don't just use my code because sometimes i find that i'll go in there and i'll check like my sales and 
I'll see that someone used my code and they don't tell me. So please, please, please DM me when you use my code because it really does help me out and you guys are the reason why I'm able to continue to work with these brands. So I just wanna let you guys know that I really appreciate it because I genuinely love the brand and I wouldn't support it if I didn't believe in it. With that being said, if you guys have any questions on sizing or something that I missed or didn't answer in the video, just leave a comment down below or you can DM me. However, the DMs get full, so I would probably comment below here instead of DMing, okay? Make sure you guys give this video a like if it helped you. And I post more frequently on Instagram and TikTok, so you guys are welcome to follow me there at Anna Workouts. Thank you guys for watching, and I think that's it. Bye-bye! Love y'all! Mm, let's do this. <laughs> okay, guys, so the first item that I'm wearing Ugh. Oh my god, literally messed up again, what the heck? I can't talk to save my life, my social anxiety. Okay, whatever.